Hello there. I want to talk to you today about one critical piece of information that your upline is probably not telling you. Now, it's not necessarily their fault, but if you're a network marketer and you've been told, just plug into the system, go take action and keep doing what you're doing. Make a list of a hundred names. Go out and speak to everybody in three feet that's breathing, right? Probably if you're in network marketing, chances are you've heard that at some point in your life. And I'm just going to show you today's kind of like a throwback Thursday in some places. And I've got a book here from 1994. And this is just one of the book of notes that I took during events that I went to back then. I think I have like 10 or 12 of those filled up like that over there on a shelf. And the interesting thing is I started looking back through these and the things that I was being taught from one event to the other, from one hotel meeting to the other, from one presentation to the other, they all ended with the same thing. Now you're ready. Go take action. Plug into the system. Follow your upline. Write a list of 100 names. Go out and talk to all these people. And when I did that over and over and over and over, and I went back again and again and again to the upline, and the upline would say, oh, don't worry about those people that say no. People are going to say no. Those are the deadbeat people. Those are people who you know, they don't want any more out of life. They're just, you know, deadbeat people. So I was left to think, okay, I've plugged into the system. I made my list of a hundred names, albeit that it's now crumbled and shredded. And, you know, I've had to recopy it so many times because upline keeps telling me, just go back and call those people again, call them until they sign up, call them until they buy something over and over and over and over again. You know, I know the, the definition of insanity is doing the same thing over and over and over and over and over again, expecting a different result, right? But there was a critical piece of information that my upline was not telling me. And I always thought back then, you know, there's got to do this. There is something these people are not telling me because all of these other people were going across the stage. The leadership was crossing the stage. They kept bringing more people in and I had talked to everything that was breathing, believe me. And it wasn't working for me. It wasn't working for me. I'm not saying this approach doesn't work. I'm just saying it didn't work for me. And it wasn't that I didn't work it. I mean, I drove miles and miles and miles. I wore out so many sets of tires on my car. I drove all night to get to a no-show, to drive all the way back, to pull in the parking lot at work, get out, go in the bathroom at work, change my clothes so it looked like I'd been home, put on my lab coat, and hit the floor and treat my patients. I did it over and over and over again. And the results were always the same. Yeah, I had a little bit of success but it wasn't anywhere close to what the six and seven figure earners were making. Now I knew there had to be something else. I knew there had to be more to that scenario than I was being told or I was being let in on. Right now, back in the day, maybe online marketing, it might've been just getting started, right? 94, probably not. 94, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 2000, 2001, 2002, 2003. By then, yeah, it was starting to go online. But yet I was still being told the same thing. Plug into the system, go take action, do it all over again. Keep calling the same people. The people that tell you no are just deadbeat people. Don't pay any attention to them. Just keep doing what you're doing, right? Hey, if you don't know who I am, I am Jan Fanzler, and this is my time, my time with you, my time for you. Come to you every Thursday afternoon at 3.30 p.m. Central Standard Time right here on my channel. And it's so good to have you with me. If you're on live, please feel free to comment below. But I wanted to talk to the network marketers today because, folks, there are things you're not being told. 
Now, it's not necessarily your upline's fault that you don't know these things, right? But you need to know there's more to the big picture than plug into the system, write out a list of 100 names and talk to everything that's breathing in your space. If you want to grow your network marketing business and you want to do it rapidly, okay? If you want to do it in a fashion that 90% of the people you talk to will be interested and chances are the majority of those people will sign up with you. If you'd like to know how to do that, I can certainly help you with that. But today it's all about that one piece of information that your upline is not telling you. And I've put a link up there, over there, somewhere. You'll find it somewhere on this video today. And I want you to go read that article. My good friend, Fernie Sabalos wrote it. And let me tell you, he is a graduate of MIT. He is a highly educated man who gave up a very sophisticated career to do network marketing. And he's been uh, in the trenches learning and investigating and researching and diving deep into all those secrets that your upline never told you. And in today's article, Fernie's going to announce to you what that one big thing is that your upline's not telling you. And don't go read it if you don't want to grow your business. Don't go read it if you're not interested in growing a large, large following. Don't go read it if you're not interested in signing up distributors rapidly. But if that's you and you are interested in doing those things, perhaps you're tired of hotel meetings. Perhaps you're tired of one-on-ones. Perhaps you're tired of having the home parties and having complete strangers invade your personal space. Maybe you're tired of that because maybe, just maybe, it's not working well for you. If it is working well for you, hey, great, shout hallelujah. But I'm going to tell you, if you want to grow your business and grow it really, really quickly, doesn't it just make sense that you would listen to a man who not only has created one or two or three seven-figure businesses for himself, but he has helped literally thousands of people in the network marketing space realize and discover these same secrets, which of one of he's going to he's going to let you know about today. But I'm just telling you, I'm here to try to help you grow your business and grow it as quickly as you possibly can. Because if you're anything like I was, when I started network marketing, I was told it was going to be easy. I was told that it was going to be as easy as one, two, three, right? One, you sign up, two, you go talk to three people, and, you know, it, it just happens that way. One, two, three, plug into the system. Sign up yourself, plug into the system, and go talk to three people. And voila, your business is going to just explode. Well, what almost exploded was me. I was so tired. I had run and run and run and run and run and run, not to mention all the family time I had missed out on, not to mention the birthdays that I missed, not to mention the times I was late to work and almost got fired, not to mention those things, not to mention driving through a blizzard snowstorm, going through West Virginia in the middle of the night, and you couldn't even see the road, only to discover the people I was going to see <laughs> was a total disappointment not to mention those things. I don't know if you've ever done any of those things. I don't know if you're still working network marketing that way, but I'm going to tell you there are numerous pieces and parts that your upline chances are may not be sharing with you. But here's the real sad part. Your upline's probably doing those exact same things. And that's why when your upline comes back to the next event, there's going to be a lot more people coming with him or her than there are with you because they know these secrets. Now they may be bound by their company in some contractual format that they're not allowed to share it with you, but you can make no mistake about it. They are doing it this way. You may not know it, but I'm going to tell you there's more to it than, than you're being told if you're still doing offline network marketing and people are still telling you, Talk to everybody within three feet. Go make your hundred names list. Plug into the system and run until you drop or die. 
just make sure you keep selling up products and make sure you keep signing up people. Even if you've got to sign up one today and replace them with three tomorrow because two of them are going to quit. Even if that's you, if that is you and you're seriously trying to build your business. I mean, if, if, if you already know network marketing is a great, great opportunity. If you already know, that yes, it can provide financial freedom and time freedom for you and your family. If you know those things already, then I know you're a smart marketer. You know, there's more to the puzzle. You know, there's more that you don't know, but the problem is you just don't know what you don't know. Well, today I'm going to start uncovering some of what you don't know that you don't know. And I'm going to share it with you. It may ruffle some feathers, may upset some network marketing people. I really don't care. I'm not in network marketing anymore. I'm here to help those people avoid the pitfalls that I went through in network marketing. Doesn't mean I won't ever be in network marketing. If a great opportunity came along, I might take a look at it because now I know the right way to do it. Now I know those secrets that I was never told. So, I'm just willing to share them out with you today. Carol Ingram's on live with us and you're right, Carol, you know the truth. It's not that easy at all. And you know, you can spend hours and hours and hours. Ask anybody, you know, in the network marketing arena, if they're not doing it online, then you're spending countless hours on the phone with people who don't care about what you're talking about. You're spending countless hours, countless dollars going from one little restaurant to the other, trying to get the waiter or the waitress's name or the cashier's name. You're chasing people down in a parking lot. You may still be going out to a shopping center of some kind, trying to hand out flyers. I don't know what all crazy stuff they're doing now. That's some of the crazy stuff I did. Okay. So it's, it's not what you have to do. There are certain skills that you have to acquire. And you need to know the people who can help you acquire those skills and find all the secrets to network marketing that you're not being told. Okay. So, Hey, listen, I hope you're having a great day. I just wanted to hop on, share this information with you. Uh, this is an incredible article. It is absolutely crucial for you to read it. If you are serious about growing your network marketing business, if you're not, Blow it off and keep going, baby, you know, and just keep doing it the old way. I hope it works for you. I really do. And uh, I hope you have good connections with somebody in your community that changes tires very frequently and can keep your motor running. Okay. Anyway, hey, you guys have a great day. This is Jan Fancer. It's been my time, my time with you, my time for you. It's always a pleasure to come out and share uh, information with you that's going to help you move you along and move you forward in your business because that is why I'm here. I'm here to help you grow your business and explode it the right way, giving you the secrets behind the scenes. Okay. Till next time, which will be Monday night, 9 30 PM central standard time. I'll be right back here with you. You're welcome. Carol Ingram. Thanks for being on live. And if you're hopping on a replay, put hashtag replay and let me know where you're coming in from. I do go back and answer the comments and you can ask Carol. She's on live. She'll tell you. Yes, I do respond. So anyway, folks, go have a great day. And it's been my pleasure sharing this information with you. Again, if you're serious about your network marketing business and if you're serious about growing it and you want to know the secrets, my friend Fernie, He's got them and he's sharing them with you. <laughs> and uh, Fernie don't really care if it ticks people off. So enjoy the read. Bye for now.